Hi, I'm Zachary Tuff. I lead our research in people analytics for Deloitte's human capital research and sensing. In this final part of our five part video series, we'll be focusing on including human insights, not relying on data alone, but adding human perspectives to provide balanced decisions and actions. What if data made all our decisions for us? For example, your vehicle's GPS tells you to go down a particular road when you can clearly see the road is closed. Do you keep driving forward? A video streaming service suggests a TV show you don't like. Do you watch it anyway? A smart refrigerator adds milk to a shopping list app the day before you leave on vacation. Do you buy it and let it go bad while you're away? You're looking to promote a sales associate who is a top salesperson but has poor interpersonal skills. Do you promote them based on sales data alone? Data is a great tool to inform your decisions, but humans need to balance data with experience, context, and strategy to make the right decisions. Data-driven decisions can be very impactful. They may help organizations achieve outcomes like higher cost savings, productivity, engagement, and revenue growth. Our high-impact people analytics research finds high-performing organizations are data-driven. In other words, they are 9.4 times more likely to make data-driven decisions, 10 times more likely to use people analytics for workforce decisions, and 11 times more likely to use people analytics for business decisions than our surveyed lower-performing organizations. To encourage balanced data-driven decisions, organizations may Leverage balanced data. By collecting information, organizations can gain insights for effective actions. However, data is not foolproof. If something feels counterintuitive or unrealistic, further vet it. And if you're running artificial intelligence programs, make sure to establish an auditing process to prevent errors. Support guided decisions. Data should be used to guide decisions, not as a justification for preconceived notions. Seek ways to gain insights up front, to influence your opinions, manage your expectations, and refine your decisions. Use discretion. Data can offer great advantages, but you need to know when and how to use it. Just because you can measure something doesn't mean you should. And a 15-minute analysis to get one key insight can be more practical than a three-month science experiment that yields interesting but less actionable findings. Creating a culture that combines data with human experience can help your organization generate the clarity and insight that can lead to impactful business decisions. To learn more, look out for the other videos in our Creating a Data Culture series.